Have you ever made love all night long? See, since you wanna make a love. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Today I'm gonna be doing a full wash day with Camille Rose products. I received a PR package from them and I decided to try the products it's it in today's videos. Um, so yeah, if you're interested in seeing what products I use, just keep on watching. Um, so let's just get into the wash day. So it's going to be my shampoo, conditioner, leave-in, and styler. Um, I'm starting off by um, just wetting my hair. Remember what I told y'all, make sure you are fully saturating your hair longer than you need to before you apply your first product. And the first shampoo that I'm using is the Kinky Curly Comb Clean. Um, I just had a protective style on, so I just want to make sure that I strip all of that dirt, build up product, build up, and all that out of my hair. So um, I've used this product a lot on my channel. If you're not new, you already know that, but this is a clarifying shampoo. Um, I use this product every, I wanna say like four to six weeks or as needed. If I have a lot of product buildup and I just need to like get my hair like super clean, um, I will use this. I also reach for this product often before and after my protective styles. Um, it's pretty cheap. I don't know how much it is. I'm gonna link it down below. <laughs> I think it's like at least like $10 or less and a little bit goes a long way. Um, so I definitely recommend this product as a um, clarifying shampoo in your routine. Definitely wouldn't like recommend using it too often. Um, so yeah, I'm just smoothing the shampoo into my hair and I am making sure that I get at my scalp. This felt so good. Y'all know whenever you have a protective style in and you <laughs> finally wash your hair, it feels so good. So yeah, I'm just doing it all over my hair before I go in with the next product. All right, and wash it and out. Make sure that all of your product is out before you move on to the next product. Um, and this is the first Camille Rose product that I'm gonna be using is the Camille Rose Sweet Ginger Cleansing Rinse. Um, it's the second shampoo that I'm using, y'all. I was so surprised by this shampoo. I really liked it. Um, when I seen cleansing rinse, excuse me, when I seen cleansing rinse, I didn't know what to think. But um, it's, I feel like it's more of like a moisturizing, shampoo like if you're gonna use this use it twice or use another shampoo before this um because it was super moisturizing and um the ingredients i'm not sure it felt like honestly it felt like i was applying a shampoo mixed with a botanical gel onto my hair um so like great for detangling great for after a protective style if you um if your hair is like super matted you haven't washed it in a while i would recommend this um as your like second shampoo i don't know how to explain it it just felt like Whatever the ingredients, like like al like an aloe shampoo, like you put some aloe vera in your shampoo or like, I don't know, some oil. I don't know how to explain it, but it had a tons of slips, tons of slip, a little bit like went a long way. I really like this. The only thing I would say is it kind of felt like, you know how it kind of felt like a little slippery after I washed the product out. Um, but that would be the only thing. I'm not sure if I just didn't wash out long enough or I think it's just the, like the ingredients and I don't have the bottle in front of me right now, but like it felt like there was like a film on top of my hair, but my hair definitely felt clean and it did a great job at detangling. So I definitely will use this skin. I was so surprised by it. So definitely recommend trying this product. Okay, and then the conditioner is the Camille Rose Moroccan Pear Conditioner. This conditioner, I um, I liked. I don't like it as much as my um, Redken conditioner, but I think it did a great job at like moisturizing my hair. I did have to um, like wet my hair a little bit um, like after I was applying it, but I think it's the same thing with this product. I can't remember. I should have like put some right with some notes down. Like I don't know if it's just this line. Like it felt like it, I had like a like a film on my hair. 
and not in a bad way i don't want to <laughs> not in like a bad way but i definitely think it did its job um after this bottle is empty i'm not sure if i would like repurchase y'all know i i don't i don't i stick to my shampoos and conditioners i don't like to go outside of it and i usually stick to um, professional salon great like <laughs> shampoos and conditioners um so after, i will continue to use it but i probably would not repurchase it Um, and then the Camille Rose Curl, Curl Love Moisture Milk Leave-In Conditioner. Y'all know I don't use leave-ins. Um, um, but yeah, so since I received it in like the PR, I decided to try it. Um, so I didn't pay for it. I would not repurchase this. I don't I don't care for leave-ins. I feel like when I'm using a botanical gel, it's not needed. It just, it takes away the hold. Um, so if you're looking for like a softer hold, I definitely would recommend trying the leave-in. Um, but I usually don't use leave-ins. I don't even think I, I have, actually I have one leave-in that um, I haven't used in a while. <laughs> um, but it was okay, definitely wouldn't repurchase. Camille Rose Curl Maker. I've tried this before, I really liked it. You know, I love botanical gels. Um, it did have a little bit of a like softer hold the last time I tried it, so I just tried to pay attention to like my application. I applied a little bit to the section first and then I split. Um, my hair into sections and applied more just to give a little bit um, like add a little more product to each section and make sure that I'm applying it thoroughly throughout my hair and then I did go in you'll see it in a little bit after this <laughs> I did go in with a little bit of the inner since I create hold just like a little like one square in each section like I said because there wasn't as much hold the last time I tried this product but I think it did a great job at defining my curls, moisturizing my hair, you know, great ingredients. Yeah, my hair super soft, like you don't have like a, like a lot of like, like you didn't have like the hard cast, like you won't like you would with um, what product? Maybe like the Uncle Funky Daughters, you'll have like a cast. Here, I went in and added the inner scents. So yeah, I am almost finished. So um, I didn't insert the clips of me drying my hair. I diffused, uh, no, I sat under the hooded dryer for a good amount of time. I haven't like used like botanical gel in a while. And I forgot how long it takes to dry your hair whenever you <laughs> apply, use a botanical gel and apply your products on soaking wet hair in the shower. Um, but I definitely like the results. So I sat under maybe for like a good 30, 45 minutes and then I diffused. Um, I try not to disturb my curls too much. Um, whenever I'm diffusing, I make sure that it's fully dry before I go in and make sure the roots are dry. I love how this came out. Like my hair um, was super soft, super defined. It was shiny. Like I really like the results. I definitely think I need like a shape, shaping trim. I don't like how my hair is shaped, but I definitely like the results. Um, like I said, I think five or six days, I can't really remember. I need to do better. I know I used to add like the progress videos, but I have been lazy. I'm trying to get back on track. Anyways, I am rambling. I really like these results. I feel like it is defined. Um, but not too much. You know, sometimes you want a little bit of like frizz. Probably not use the leave-in the next time, but use the curl maker or the, yeah, the curl maker and then add the inner scents on top. And I definitely recommend trying uh, the shampoo if you haven't. The conditioner, maybe not, but definitely try out that shampoo because I was so surprised by the results. The two products that I would recommend from the Camille Rose line that I use today is the shampoo as well as the curl maker um, like I said it didn't have enough like as much hold 
as some other botanical gels that you would use but like I said, there were a lot of other benefits. Let me know if you have tried any of these products before, um, if you enjoyed this video, if you found it helpful. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I'm sending you love and positive energy, and I hope you carry that with you throughout your day. Peace.